Hey everyone, it's Ivan with KitBadger.com here to bring you another gear review. Today we're talking about the Air Purge Dry Compression Sack by Outdoor Research. This compression sack is made out of a laminated nylon, this hydro seal material. What that does is give it its waterproof ability. And then down here, this orange band is the air purge. What it is, is an air permeable waterproof band that when you compress something in here, it allows air to escape, but water not to get in. It allows you to compress something really small with that. Along the side, you can see there's a little daisy chain of nylon. If you wanna lash this to something. Down at the bottom here, you got a handle. And at the top, we have our rolling seal. So we roll up like this. And of course our buckle and a little D-ring right here if we wanna clip something onto there. And then of course on the sides you have your pull tabs for your compression. Question being of course, is this waterproof? I thought so, said it's waterproof, but earlier in the season, thinking outside the box, I was up here with my boys on a backpacking trip and usually I pretty much throw my food in here once I get to camp lash it 550 cord string it up no problem or if there's a bear box i'll use a bear box i don't carry a bear canister so get up to these lakes and there's no trees and i'm like okay no bear box i'm like you know what i'm smarter than the average bear so what i did was filled this with all my food sealed it up got rid of the air rolled this guy up nice and tight clipped it then tied some 550 cord to this little D-ring right here. After a length of 550 cord, tied that 550 cord to a giant rock. After another length, tied it to a big rock on shore, right next to the lake, right? So I take this full of my food and a big heavy rock and pitch this thing out into the lake. And it goes, <laughs> rock sinks down. This thing's bobbing like this. I'm like, ha. Huh. No bear is going to get my food. And consequently, no bear did get my food. Probably wasn't a bear in like 20 miles. But when I opened up the next morning, water got in. It was not waterproof. And I was disappointed. My coffee beans got wet. It was terrible. So my confidence in this piece of gear is shaken. And I don't know that probably part of the issue was this was suspended this portion even though it was rolled up nice and tight was suspended underwater probably would have been okay maybe if i had tied off this handle at the bottom so this part was above water i don't know but what i have here is my down sleeping bag i love down because it's super cozy really light and incredibly compressible but if it gets wet party's over you will just freeze to death because it loses all ability to insulate you once it gets wet. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna stuff this guy in here and then I'm gonna take a swim across this lake and see if it's dry on the other side. I've got this thing in there now. I'm gonna go ahead and uh, use these straps, compress it down a little bit and should be ready to go. Tie a little lanyard on this guy. Change into my shorts and go for a swim. All right, I have a feeling I'm about mm, 10 seconds out from serious regret. You know I try so hard, but I think you don't see because I'm moving so fast. We don't live right in right I want to see you just because you're on to me. You are the boss of to be you're always straight and rolling. incredibly cold for reference oh, sorry still super cold 
For reference, this morning there was ice on top of my tent from when it rained and then it got cold enough to freeze. But let's see if I have to immediately hike down because my sleeping bag is wet. Looks like a tiny bit of water right on the inside of the seat, probably the first or second foot. But uh, dry sleeping bag. I'm glad it's dry. I'll probably climb into it in a second. You can get these a bunch of different sizes, anywhere from I think 5, 8, 10, 15, 20, and like 35 liter. Some really big ones. This I believe is either the 8 or 10. And you can get them best place, probably off of Amazon, get the best deal. The I think 8 or 10 liter is right around 35 bucks, 36 bucks. They range anywhere from like low 20s to like 50 bucks depending on size. Great piece of gear, keep your down sleeping bag dry. And uh, yeah, it's cold, I'm gonna go change. Thanks for joining us at kitbadger.com. Oh, 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 oh,